Good afternoon, dear viewers. I am glad to welcome you to the Soval Mesh channel. Today, we will visit our site, see what work is being done, what has already been completed, and discuss what still lies ahead. In fact, we are currently standing to the left of the building. We can see that the landscaping of the area is already in full swing. An automatic irrigation station has been installed and the lawn has already been seeded. Very soon, a green layer will grow here and it will all look very beautiful, dignified and noble. The fence has been installed as you have already seen earlier. We also cannot overlook the increasing number of vehicles here, which is constantly growing because on the one hand, the number of employees from contracting organizations performing construction work is increasing. And on the other hand, the number of employees at Sovolmash is also rising. Yes, the hiring process is currently ongoing and we are actively staffing up as new workspaces become available. First of all, we currently need design engineers. So if you are currently one, you can send your resume to our official email. Now, let's go inside the building and take a look at the condition as we approach the completion of the construction project. That is the ZOS. <laughs> We have entered the first floor of the administrative and business complex, ABC. Let's see what is happening here. There are clear and informative signs on the doors indicating different areas, such as the office and the exhibition hall, helping visitors navigate the building easily. There is also one office, a second office, and a dispatch room. That is, there are concealed installation doors where all the communications are hidden. A ceiling covering has been installed. Right now, the guys are periodically dismantling something, adding certain elements, and addressing specific comments that arise from the construction commissions and in general from the supervisory authorities. Fire communications have been installed. Marking is ongoing. I would even say it is already nearing completion. Signs are being installed for, let us say, you compliance with fire safety requirements and notification devices for upcoming events have been installed, for example. You can use the elevator. By the way, regarding the comments, sometimes interesting moments arise when a certain component is not available and a different one is temporarily installed. So, is this a comment? A comment. Is it easy to fix? Very easy. And it will be done soon. Now let's take a ride in the elevator. Everything is already operating in normal mode. You can even turn on the ventilation, for example, in case there is a large number of passengers on board. You can turn it off. It's extremely convenient indeed. The safeguarding and protective transport materials have already been completely, securely and efficiently removed. The elevator even speaks. So, here we can also observe various types of construction equipment and scaffolding that are being used. Certain finishing touches are also being completed. Similarly, there are signs everywhere. The walls have been restored, or rather, assembled, constructed, and painted. All of this now looks as good as new. Currently, all the switches are indeed working properly. The indicators and signs for the workrooms are the same. People are currently working. Everything is operating smoothly and efficiently, as usual, as it always does. Enter the production area, the first floor. What has changed here? We can immediately see a considerable number of machines. These are lathes, these are milling CNC machines, and these are lasers. We have seen the lasers before, but recently there has been a significant increase in the number of milling and lathe machines. We have shown you all of this in our videos, so we won't go into detail. I will just mention this large, extremely enormous lathe. We needed to process the housings of the 318 size motor wheels aircraft engines, and everything that is based on them, and other related components. So, I think the guys will provide you with more detailed and beautiful footage of how everything looks right now. Plus, we can see that the work is still ongoing. Currently, the guys are working on the fire communications, finishing all the necessary tasks, so to speak. And overall, the matter is indeed approaching its conclusion. This room, specifically in particular, has been designated and allocated for the assembly area. There was a line for assembling general industrial engines from sizes 86 to 132. It has now moved and is already in its rightful place. 
And of course, as you may already be aware, there is now currently a vacancy here right now. You will find out for what purpose a little later. Now we have moved to the third floor in the production area. We see the premises that we need for placing the engineering communications of the system. These are air purification systems, smoke removal systems, supply ventilation and so on. And there are actually quite a few such premises here. That is, there are, again, fire safety cabinets. We see that the repairs are almost complete. The premises are already being cleaned. We can see that all the ventilation shafts, communications, junction boxes, fire safety lines have also been installed up near the ceiling. If we step into this room, we can confidently shout, hey, hey, how beautifully and interestingly put, right? Large monstrous structures. Everything is intended for the same purpose we discussed earlier. And the entire third floor is filled with such rooms. Naturally, there are automation cabinets everywhere. All of this will operate in an automatic mode, and the microclimate here will be exactly what we need. And now we have currently moved to our surface mount line, SMD assembly. Here we see printers, and here we see poop boards, such as these. By the way, these are actually the boards for controllers for angle grinders. We can see the installer here at the moment. And here we can already observe the soldered boards. Moreover, they are soldered using an automated method. This is the equipment itself, which I congratulate all of us on. The performance of this installation is quite high. It will now be expanded and equipped with additional installers, which will allow for further expansion. The range of various and different sizes and modifications of the boards that we will be able to work with. And all of this will help in building our business together. And this is the so-called window to nature. And in fact, it is called a gateway. It is necessary, as we have mentioned multiple times, for the delivery of oversized cargo, materials, instruments, machines, and everything that would be quite difficult to move in an elevator. Therefore, it is a very unique item. And it should be noted that, well, indeed, of course, I can't assert anything here, but after we had this design, similar products also started appearing on some rental buildings of our neighbors as well. Aren't we the trendsetters? Well, at least it's convenient. Here, the formation of the winding section begins. With winding machines already in place, coils will be wound here and sections will be done automatically. Naturally, there should be a storage area for copper here, that is, not a warehouse, but at least a working storage area, operational, yes, for what we will take and, in fact, pack into these machines. The number of keys keeps increasing. Well, we won't go in here with you. Here we can also see that there is a tool storage. It has also moved here. Unusual machine, one is currently installed temporarily. And most interesting part is the line has not only moved to this room, but has already been commissioned. It remains to connect all the necessary and essential communications and it can be put into use. At the same time, we can see that the preparation is in full swing. Specialized carpets and bedding are already in place. Therefore, this room will be operational. the conclusion of this video is that the project is indeed in the final stage of completing the construction site. We are getting very, very close to this. There are still comments that Dmitry Alexandrovich Duinov indeed mentioned during the recent webinar. All processes are being prepared, workstations are being set up, and we are staffing with personnel. It should be noted that preparations for the implementation of the commercial part of the project are also in full swing. 
thank you for your attention and thank you for your support. We are making the final finishing pushes and are starting to tackle the tasks for which all of this was planned. We have been working diligently and meticulously to ensure everything is perfect. Thank you for your patience and support.